I'm out there with the worst case scenario for the Republican Party that they do indeed screw up on Obamacare and tax reform. Come on in, Brett Baer, host of Special Report. I want your reaction. Again, I have to ask you the same old question. Am I going too far here, Brett Baer? <laughs> you know, I, I don't think so, uh, Stuart. You're right in, in painting that way, that it could happen. But, but it's important to, to think about a couple of things. One is, um, this health care bill did cross a key hurdle today, and that is the Budget Committee. There were a number of Freedom Caucus members, conservative members, on the Budget Committee, and uh, they got it through. It was a slim vote, but it is now moved on. Uh, it's very possible that it passes the House, and the question is what happens in the Senate. Now, the health care bill could be struck down, and the Senate could build a health care bill, believe it or not, from scratch, according to parliamentary rules, and send something back that is meets all of the requirements uh, that all sides, sides yeah. want. So it's not, it's not done yet, even if it fa fails in the Senate. Tax reform is key, and I think that, that, that you're right. If they don't get that done, that businesses and uh, a lot of people who are pulling for for the Trump administration would uh, really, really be, be I, upset. I, I guess the sausage making is really ugly. And I didn't realize how strung out it could get because we're in the middle of it or we're starting to get into it. And it really looks to be extremely complicated. And you've got a divided Republican Party, uh, total opposition from the Democrats, and a president who's trying to bring his Republicans together. And it looks like he's having a pretty hard time doing it. No, that's right. And, and you may see a lot of other horse trading going on before you get to the end of this legislative effort. I think also uh, there are going to be some, some pressures put on some people about uh, you know, whether they're going to be primaried or not, or whether the, the Trump administration is going to advocate for them in re-election. I mean, you're going to get to that Washington moment where it's going to be this binary choice about how to go forward. Uh, the reason they have to do health care first is because with the savings that the health care yep. bill provides, it then gives the breathing room for them to get the rates down on tax reform to a place that they want to get them without blowing up the deficit and debt. You know what, Brett? I'm going to leave politics to you. I'll stick with <laughs> money if that's okay. That sounds good. <laughs> You're on your own. All Brett right. Baer, see you tonight at 6 o'clock. Thank you very much, sir. Appreciate it. Thanks, Stuart. Yes, sir.